Hey guys, we're going to talk today about these uh, little speedy stitch sewing awls. Uh, you see these things all over. This one here is the Harbor Freight version. It's like six bucks. Uh, you can pick these things up for anywhere from like five dollars up to like ten or fifteen, depending on what brand they are and what features they have. They're very simple. They're like a little hand sewing machine. They work terrific, and they are an absolute must-have for people who are into wilderness survival, prepping, homesteading, anything that uses self-reliance, this is a piece of gear that you have to have and have to be familiar with. Now, you know, as it, um, I'm going to keep the preaching to a minimum, but you know, like I always say, most prepping videos are about guns, food, and ammo, and medical supplies and things like that, and we ignore the little things like this. And these are really important things. And honestly, if you don't have one of these for your bug out bag or, you know, even just in your home for in case of an emergency, you're really kind of hurting yourself. And what these are, these are, are very simple hand sewing machine. They uh, have a little spool inside where you put your thread. It runs through the needle, comes out, and it acts just like a sewing machine, except you have to tie by hand. Now, I'm not going to demonstrate... There are literally like 2,000 videos on YouTube that demonstrate how to use these things. I'm, you know, I'm not going to subject you guys to it. I'm sure you guys got better stuff to do. But this is something you have to have. This will go through, you know, leather. This will go through nylon webbing. You can use it to fix and repair your clothing. Make your own gear. Um, you know, in a bug out situation, there's just too much that you could use this for not to have one in the weight, you know, you're talking a couple of ounces, you know, great thing to have. They have different tips, you know, a straight tip, a uh, curved tip, all different kinds of stuff. You can use all different kinds of thread in them, you know, to not have one of these around is, is kind of insane because, you know, in a bug out, you're likely going to only have a limited amount of clothing, a limited amount of gear. You're going to have to make repairs, and this is something you can do it, and do it with a nice heavy-duty thread that's not going to uh, break easily. I've used this to make a couple of, uh, sew together some nylon webbing and stuff like that, and repair some gear over the past like, year or so, and I was thinking about it, and I kind of said, you know, I really got to do a video on this, because this is just one of those cheap, must-have items we all overlook, and... You know, it's it's simple, it's easy, you can throw it in a drawer, forget about it. One day the power is out, your gear breaks, you have to bug out. This is something you should have handy and uh, have available to you because, you know, when, when the assembly lines stop and we can't get those cheap imported goods from China anymore, you're going to have to learn to fix and repair your own things. So it's a good idea to start now, practice now, and get something like this down because... When the time comes, that's not when you want to be sitting around learning. So I hope you enjoyed. Simple, quick, easy, sewing all. Ten different people make them. Ten different prices. All different stores. You know, you pick. None are better than the other. They're all pretty much made in China. You know, they're bomb proof. Nothing's going to happen to them. They're easy. You can store the needle right in the cap. Throw it in your bag. Throw it in your pack. Leave it in your car. Whatever. They're just... A must have.